That's the uh, reason why they built something like this, to convenience his own people, and he, and then he was the chosen one. But he couldn't, because Kapan anyway. Boom. Kaput. They didn't need blah, 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 blah. I mean, politicians, where they were. They need something like food and health and peace. Things that they didn't have in the point. Kingdom kids just keep an eye. But what percentage of the people did you say were actually literate, able to read? 90. The 99% of them couldn't read and write at all. So this would have been lost on them. Exactly. Yeah. Only few people can. Hmm. Actually, this is not something where they built for the... Uh, oh, no, actually, not even for the nobles. Sorry. Allergy. <laughs> this is something what they built for their gods. Oh, so gods. Yeah. To say, well, see, I am a chosen one. Yep. So each one in the soda has a signature team. The 15th one got this, 16th got that, strong, 14th may have their own. Right? Something else, like mm -hmm. the uh, temple that you can see out there, for example. That, that was built for the uh, 13th. So oh. It's not really built for a posterity. Well, you know what? Sometimes. Yeah. Sometimes. This is sort of a documented history, right? Some, some of the kings, you know, buildings have been reused by the okay. next of the king just to oh. save some okay. so keep it up this kind of a... It's like a presidential library. <laughs> <laughs> what was the average population of this dinosaur dynasty? Dinosaur? 20, a million? 200,000? 200,000? 200, 200, uh, 25,000 or 27,000 people. That's what the... Uh, that's it. I think, I think by myself, that's my point of view, Marvin's idea, and yeah. they, were, they were more than that, yeah. see? I think there were like 200,000 people, but mm -hmm. science says 25,000, 27,000 people. How could you build temples? I know, this big, yeah. They have uh, to work how, on it every how, day. Why? How come they used to have those kind of huge plazas? Because this is like a three times bigger than a full field yeah. uh, area. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. No. So what about the army? What about the... Uh, uh, the uh, agricultures, what about the uh, the traders, and what about all those kind of, uh, you know, different people making different kind of, uh, you know, uh, activities. So I think they were more than that. I'm agree with this. Yeah. Hmm? Actually, because they used to have a kind of a polygamy system in their society. And there were no TVs at all. <laughs> <laughs> So, so the other 15% they can't discern, is it because of erosion, they don't understand the glyphs? What? Both. 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 Mm -hmm. Roofing system of mines, that is a very good example. Oh, yeah. Wow. I see. Yeah. Oh, the middle. Oh, yeah. Right. Mm -hmm. And uh, this is the uh, ball court, and this is the middle line of a plaza. This is what you say, or what you call like the 15th uh, jar line. Oh. See? And there were two champs. One of them over here. And vice versa. Yeah. Five members of a team right Ball there, court. and vice versa. And they used to play like this. Like that word and forward, that word and forward. But they were not allowed to use their hands, feet, I mean, head. I'm sorry. <laughs> well, you never know. Sometimes it's just like an upside down decision. Feet, head. They couldn't. But the rest of the body parts, like elbows, shoulders, hips, knee. Legs, okay. and the uh, ball what they used to play was about three or four kilograms. Wow. Hmm? What's that again? Kilograms. Three or four kilograms. Seven Rubber pounds. ball. Oh, Solid. pretty heavy, right? Yeah. Nine and a half or nine pounds. Ten pounds. Okay. I have seen them up you know, by Rubber playing ball. this kind of game a few ago. Huh. Oh, oh. Really? I have seen them up you know, by playing this kind of game a few ago. Mm. It was very interesting. There were some uh, people from Harvard, you know, uh, I mean, uh, National Geographic Society, mm. who broke down, you know, steel mine descendants from, from Mexico just to reenact this kind of a game. Mm. It was amazing. Mm. They were dressing up the same kind of costumes what they used to dress up. Mm. They were using the same kind of bowl what they used to play and everything. Yeah? There is a videotape, what they call like a lost kingdom of the mines. Through, through the net, and you will find okay, it. Okay, okay. Uh, Lost mm. Kingdom. Mm -hmm. Yep. To see how, the way how they used to play this kind of game. <laughs> they were not human sacrifices, you know, during this kind of a reenactment. That was a big shame, I think. <laughs> yeah, because I was expecting for everything. Actually, I was just hiding back there with my machete, and it was just, hey guys, what about the human sacrifices? <laughs> <laughs> they were just running away, you know. <laughs> Too bad. But the rest of the thing, what they, what they did, yeah, it was just amazing. 
and heating up the bowl like that. Okay, guys, there you go. Ba, ba, ba. And then they got those kind of uh, heads that you see sticking out of a corner. Yeah. That's a target. Wow. Because oh. by heating them up is the way how they used to make goals. Of course. Any one of them? Yeah. If okay. you have a team over here, they must have hit it up the ones that you can see right there. Mm. Okay. Mm -hmm. The other one, team back there, must have hit up the ones that you can see right there. Th those two are not whole goals. No. Those two. Because this is just like the uh, half line. The center line. There you go. And what's the uh, function of those kind of uh, slopes? Of the, the uh, signs? The ball can roll down. down. Yeah. Actually, because the people were allowed to run on those kind of things mm -hmm. in the front oh. middle, mm -hmm. they were not allowed to come across the other side. Mm -hmm. That's why you have a line. Where are the audiences? Back there. Oh. Oh. Those are like the, they were like the uh, VIP ones. And the rest of the people like me? <laughs> <laughs> standing there. there. Standing yeah. out yeah. and sitting on the floor sometimes. Mm. Yeah. Come on, we'll take you on. Oh! <laughs> VIP seats over there. <laughs> are those the betting windows up there? There you go. <laughs> Locker rooms. Come the ball folks, made of standing uh, leather? Here. No, the, rubber. Uh, Rubber. Did they have a record? Of that? <laughs> actually, 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 they found one. Yeah, right. Did they find one? Well, not exactly like uh, from these time periods, mm. but from the post-classic time period. Oh, they yes. found one. Yep. The uh, Spanish people were writing down about those kind of uh, mm. you know ceremonial activities what they made. They used to play a kind of a funny game, a crazy game with a rubber ball, which is like solid one, and you know. Mm. Was actually, Hernan Cortez, one of the uh, Spanish conquistadors. Mm -hmm. Uh, send them up one of the uh, players from the uh, Yucatan Peninsula to Spain to show this kind of uh, you know crazy game what they used to play. Um, yep. Is that where the leader sits? No. Yep. <laughs> no. He was up there. Oh, he was up there. I know there's not any kind of a symmetry between the uh, structure and the uh, yeah. throne that you can see up there. Mm -hmm. But it's because this kind of a you know uh, podium had been used by him to see everything what happened. And the rest of a plaza, not just this. But the rest of the oh. ceremonial activity didn't happen mm -hmm. in the plaza. Mm -hmm. He never moved, just like, you know, drinking a Coca Cola and popcorn. <laughs> and, uh, okay, guys, go ahead. Like what? Baseball. Baseball. The one inch units a vertical wall thing, ring in the middle, and they pass the ball through the ring. Yeah. A basketball. The one in Copan looks like and just looks like bowling ball. Mm -hmm. Because the team, they were paddling out the ball like this, you know, from team to team, back and forward. Okay. Uh, in Michoacan, Mexico, El Area Purepecha, like we call it today, there are some people playing a kind of a game with, uh, with a kind of a stick, you know, like golf stick or like a yeah, hockey stick, and a ball on fire. Hmm. How come the uh, ball was on fire? What was the uh, representation of the uh, ball according to the Mayan uh, cosmogony? Sun. Sun. Exactly, that's why the uh, ball was on fire. Sun, Moon, and, and Venus planet, the most brightly things up there in heaven. And then, they used to play like this. Okay. With the ball on fire. That is just amazing. Okay. Absolutely amazing. How did they generate the fire? How did they... I'm sorry? How did they make the fire on the fire? Well, with the, uh, in the past, with two stone pieces, like a plain stone pieces. You see? Mm. And then, by using grease of animals, uh, the rest of trees like uh, like a pine tree. Mm -hmm. yeah. 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 Fire. So you can create fire. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. That's what they use for candles too. On the on the on the ball. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So that's a ball. What's the middle one? Uh, that is something what we found beneath the, the statue. Then you can see right there. It was like uh, four or five meters beneath mm -hmm. the statue. And so one, it's not a Mayan, you know, uh, sculpture. This is one of the old make. Oh you know, figures. Oh, yeah. By the way, Mexico, yeah. by the way, you were asking me about. Did they knew about uh, rubber, and then rubber trees? Yes, they did. Actually, the knowledge about rubber trees and rubber and the game is older than the Mayan people civilization. It had been created by Olmec, and Olmec used to be like the uh, mother civilizations of other countries. From Olmec, Mayas, Toltecs. Aztecs. Yeah. That's why they used to have exactly the same kind of a god, like the Almighty one among themselves. Yeah, yeah. And this is one of the Olmec uh, figure representations. And Olmec means rubber man. Oh. What time period was that? It's like uh, 1,500 1, years before the Mayans. Yeah. That's in Mexico City, right? Yeah, Me Mexico. This is it. So the people who are going to see the tunnels, the whole way back 
into the uh, Jaguar flat stuff where you have seen those kind of uh, Jaguar standing up you know, figures. And we have some guards at the entrances of the tunnels just to see what we have. Seen. Break. They don't fight anymore in the market. But the countryside, especially in the highlands, is still vulnerable for the disaster because many Indians out there, they still use it adobe bricks. Slumber. Look at that. Look at that over there. No, not this one. That's have to be... This one here on the right, look. See, it goes down, see it? So inside the cliff is the other slum. Come on, Engineers? Hmm? Engineers? Yeah. No, 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 no not the university. Not the technical. That's the soccer stadium. They called Matthew Flores. Matthew Flores. He was 